Earning a golf scholarship is hardly something new, but what if you don't play the game? have no interest in playing, don't even know about it. You can still find a way to a full ride here on the golf course. Shantae Wilson, a senior at Bard High School in Baltimore, has earned a full four-year ride to the University of Maryland starting this fall. I intend to study biology. I want to be a veterinarian. An award from the Evans Scholars Program designed specifically for golf caddies. Shantae had never played golf, but left at the chance two years ago to grab a bag if it meant college was paid for. Someone from the first day had told us about a caddy academy that they would be hosting over the summer where you can meet people and get out into the environment and get paid. We at First Tee are, the golf almost comes secondary, you know, we're trying to teach the life skills that, that golf teaches you inherently, you know, honesty, integrity, perseverance, using good judgment, things like that. After the academy, Shantae began caddying at Baltimore Country Club, but after just one round, she thought she might quit. When I initially started, I was clueless. I had no clue what was going on. I didn't know where I was supposed to go. I didn't really understand what was happening because I'd never really been in anything sports related. Jack Palmer of the Western Golf Association that first created the Evans Scholars Program became Shantae's regular loop and loved how she grew into the job. She had no idea what was going on. She didn't know what direction we were going, but every week she came back, she tried. She came back, she tried. And she learned two words, hustle and perseverance. My grandmother, mediocrity and quitting was not something that she allowed us to do. I understood that I wasn't the best initially, but I thought if I didn't at least try and push, then I would never know. And so I did, and it, it worked out. Shantae is the sixth caddy to earn an Evans scholarship from here at Baltimore Country Club, and there's a host of more than 20 caddies in the pipeline hoping to follow in her footsteps. Here at BCC, Pete Gilbert, WBAL, TV 11 Sports.